Before beginning, exercise the wrench across the torque range of the tool on a bolt several times in both directions. In this video, we will set and apply 65 foot-pounds of torque. Locate the vertical center line with graduated horizontal marks at 10 foot-pound increments. Identify the scale at the edge of the adjusting collar that measures in 1 foot-pound increments. Pull outward on the lock ring at the base of the handle to unlock for adjustment. Starting from the lowest torque setting, rotate the handle clockwise to increase torque, always adjusting torque from lower to higher. Rotate until the vertical center line aligns with the 60 foot-pound horizontal line. Then continue clockwise until the 5 on the center line is set to a torque value of 65 foot-pounds. Release the spring-loaded lock ring to lock the torque. Engage the socket over the square drive. Position the wrench at about 90 degrees to the right so that you can pull and not push on the wrench. Pull the wrench slow and steady from the middle of the handle while avoiding any jerking motion. Stop pulling once the audible and tactile click indicates target torque has been reached. Relax your pull, remove the wrench, and proceed to the next bolt. It is not necessary or advisable to pull it a second time. Never use the wrench for breakout or loosening operations, as this may result in damage of the tool and loss of accuracy. An extension or cheater bar should never be used. When complete, wipe down the tool, reset it to the lowest torque setting, and store in the case. 